Hey Reclaim, you might have heard the news. I'm running for city council at large for the 2023 primary and I'm so honored to have the opportunity to earn your endorsement. As a co-founder and the former political director of Reclaim, I've spent the past six years building and leading our organization, electing our leaders to office and deeply investing in the leadership of community members citywide. I've worked to build Reclaim with you from non-existent to an organization that has won cycle after cycle, has more than 800 dues paying members and has changed what's politically possible in Philly. Now, as I'm taking this next step to build a better Philly for all of us, again, I'm so deeply honored and excited at the opportunity to earn your support. I've worked for years to put political power into the hands of working people. All of you here know that better than anyone else. That's why I was the campaign manager of Reclaim members, Senator Nikhil Saval and Representative Elizabeth Fiedler. I demanded health care for workers at the airport with our comrades at Unite Here and was arrested. And I experienced the stark contrast between the city's response to George Floyd's murder and the response to white supremacists who attacked me, my partner, and my friends, and so many of you at Marconi Plaza. I've organized white people to see that we have more in common with our black and brown neighbors than we do with our bosses. Organizing is how we elected Rick and Nikhil and Elizabeth and Kendra and Larry and Helen. Oh my God, so we've elected so many people together. And that's how we've won Fair Work Week. It's how we won local control of our schools. It's how we won the Domestic Workers Bill of Rights. It's how we won a moratorium of evictions during the pandemic. And it's how we won the whole Home Repairs Fund. Organizers on the inside fighting for us and powerful communities filled with organizers on the outside making the impossible inevitable. And organizing is how we'll win this campaign too, with hundreds of leaders across our city organizing our neighbors. As our city is facing an overdose crisis, schools with so little funding, but lots of asbestos and mold, skyrocketing housing prices, a gun violence epidemic, a never ending pandemic, and we're all working more jobs than ever while making less money than ever. We're faced with a choice. Will we allow what we've won to be taken from us or will we keep organizing, fighting and winning to make Philly better for all of us? When I was in middle school, our family was evicted because our landlord hiked up our rent during early Fishtown gentrification. I had lived on a block surrounded by family who knew me and looked out for me. And after we were evicted, I felt alone in a neighborhood that was just as unsafe, but without the protections of community to keep me safe. We must make sure every resident of our city has a safe, stable home. So many of us are faced with increasingly unaffordable rents and unsafe housing. We're experiencing a housing crisis and one of the biggest costs of it is it robs us of safety, stability, community and belonging. Housing is a human right. We need more permanently affordable housing and we need those homes to be owned by regular people, not just a few landowners and big developers. If Philly had protections for renters that prevented huge raises in rent like rent control, my family would have been able to stay in our home. And as your council member, I'll fight for home ownership and housing stability to be for everyone, not just the wealthy or lucky. As an organizer and community leader, I fought alongside you to make our city a better place to live. And that's what I'll do as your next council member. I'm ready to bring my winning record to council and make this a seat for the people, but I won't do it without you. I'm honored to earn Reclaim support and I'll wear it proud. I ask that you vote for me to endorse me early and I am so grateful for your support, every single Reclaim member. Thank you.